Hello, this is Crystal Reviews, and today we are going to be reviewing Going for the One. So, first off, this album was released in 1977, um, and the first uh, track starts off with this um, which is Going for the One, and is starts off sort of bluesy and rock and roll. Um, then it, it, it just gets more awesome, it like kicks in, and then they'll get the lyrics, love the lyrics, and they have this great guitar solo, great vocals, I love Anderson's voice, um, great guitar, keyboards. It's great. Perfect 10. Next, we have Turn of the Century. Um, it's a great acoustic song with um, these great lyrics. Um, um, Anderson's voice is great in this album. Like It's not over-polished like it is in uh, Relayer. <coughs> Um, uh, sound chaser, anyone? No. Yeah, but the lyrics are great. Um, Anderson's voice, it's a nice, calming song. Love the keyboards. I and guitar parts. I love the chiming instruments. I think they're like towards the middle, but they're great. Next we have Parallels, we'll have to tell the last song. And then, so it starts off this keyboard intro. This keyboard, then, then the bass kicks in. Um, the lyrics are great, great vocals, great solo. Um, key. Great keyboards, um, love the structure, it's a 10. So, then track 4 is Wonder Stories, it's another acoustic song. Um, let's see, it has great vocals, um, great lyrics, a mellow track, a really mellow track. I love the feel of this song. Love the guitar solo. It's ten. And track five is Awaken. So the song sort of starts off like Seven Seas of Rye. It sort of starts off like that. Um, but and it's like the last track. I mean, I love the keyboards and the vocal. Are great guitar is awesome. The solo is great. And they have this quiet chime section, sort of like um, turn of the century. Um, uh, the guitar, the guitar is awesome. The solo is great, and they have this quiet chime section that goes really mellow. And then vocals come back, and it's a 10. And then, okay, so, um, overall, Going for the One is a great album. Definitely recommend it, and it is an underrated classic. But, um, like I said earlier, um, I give this album to a new Yes fan later. Because, um, I mean, it's an essential, but later, it's a perfect 100. Check it out.